Hi Stags! Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, ipapakita ko lang sa inyo kung paano ko ba ginagawa itong glam na appropriate for an everyday makeup. Before I start with our makeup tutorial, I always use a moisturizer. And for today, we're going to use this one from Caris. This is their Madeka Suicide Sika Cream. So I have this in my Caris shop. Kung interested kayo yung bumili at tingin yun naman sobrang yupi yupi na siya kasi gamit ko to pang araw araw talaga. Bukod sa sobrang moisturizing niya, kahit pa paano pina prevent niya yung pag spread ng pimples ko or dumami pa yung pimples ko, especially on days na hindi ako nagmi makeup. Next to our moisturizer, we are going to use a primer. And as a primer for my everyday makeup, I've been using this one. So this is the Peach C Peach Glow Makeup Base. So ang nagustuhan ko sa primer naman na to ay sobrang bango niya. Yung bangong parang amoy peach or amoy citrus. Tapos, it gives you that really really light glow na parang medyo glowy ka ganun. So ang consistency nito ay ganito. Para siyang white. Pero pag in-apply mo siya sa face mo, parang medyo nagpipinky siya or nagpipitchy. Alam ko kung nakikita niyo yung medyo hint of peach color. So what I love about this product is even though we dibigay niya sa'yo yung parang oily glow or yung natural glow na almost glass skin effect. Kung nakikita niyo, wala pang foundation. Hindi siya mabigat sa mukha at hindi siya yung sobrang oily. And kung makikita niyo lang sa personal talaga, hindi ko kasi alam kung medyo nakikita niyo sa camera. Pero once na in-apply mo siya sa skin mo, medyo nagpipinkish yung glow niya. For our foundation, we are going to use this one from Maybelline. This is their 24-hour full coverage foundation. Kung nakikita niyo, sobrang ubus na siya kasi favorite ko talaga ito yung promise ginagamit ko talaga pang everyday sa so work, sa date, sa ganya. Basta, kung meron man akong foundation na basta ko na lang kinukuha sa lagayan ko na alam kong kaya kong panindigan <laughs> ay ito, itong foundation na to from Maybelline. Bukod sa super affordable, maganda rin yung coverage at maganda yung finish niya para sa akin. Sobrang hiyang siya sa skin ko, ganun. So, lagay ko lang siya muna. One pump lang to. And then after that, I'll just blend it out using a blending brush. Okay, always a rule if you're using a brush in blending your foundation, pababa lagi yung stroke. Ako ha, pabilog, tapos pababa. Kasi yung strand dung hairs na meron tayo sa face natin ay pababa. So, parang sinusundan lang natin siya. After that, pag feeling ko meron siyang mga streaks, syempre, pag minsan kasi pag brush, hindi siya enough. So, ginugo over ko pa siya with a blending sponge para lang makuha pa yung excess. So, after that, normally, I don't conceal anything na kasi kung nakakita niya parang na-conceal na nung foundation yung lahat na kailangan niya Conceal. Pero kung medyo gusto kong i-brighten up yung some parts of my face, I use this one from Maybelline ulit. This is their H Rewind na Treatment Concealer. And this is in the shade Sand. Sobrang ganda nito kasi hindi siya yung concealer na nagbibitak-bitak or sobrang dry. Yung consistency niya para siyang velvety. I just use this to highlight some parts of my face. After that, I use a blending sponge. And blend it all out. Okay, so next to that, this may seem weird kasi I go to blush. Kasi nga yung ginagamit kong blush is cream blush. So this is my favorite as of the moment. This is from Everblena. This is their EB Matte Color Stick. And this is in the shade Dull Face. So this is not a sponsored video. There are no sponsorships in this video. At lahat ng ginagamit ko dito ay yung talagang ginagamit ko for my everyday. Kung medyo na-overhype ko sila, don't worry. That's really how I feel about the product talaga. But anyway, so I'll just use this as a blush. Ang ginagamit gawa ko ay nilalagay ko muna siya dito sa my, ano ba, ring finger ko and then apply ko siya dyan pag ganyan. Weird ba? Pero nakakasatisfy ang ganyan pagkakalagay ko. Pero ganyan. Tapos lagay ko rin sa ano yung excess in case meron. Don't worry, hindi nyo, hindi nyo kailangan magmadaling i-blend out siya agad kasi since this is cream, sobrang blendable niya pa talaga. Ayan. Tapos tsaka ko siya i-blend out. Tapos, kukuha na lang ako ng konting amount and then dito naman sa kabila. Tinataas ko siya kasi nakakabata daw yun yung pag mataas yung blush mo hanggang dito, ganun. Nakakabata daw. Tapos, blend out mo siya ulit using yung pinang-blend out mo ng 
ng foundation at ng concealer kanina. For my everyday, hindi talaga ako nagbe-bake. So, I'm going to use this one from Maybelline. This is their Fit Me Powder. And this is in the shade um, 310 or Sun Beige. Ang ginagawa ko lang dito, kumakuha ko ng powder brush. And then, lightly ko siyang nilalagay. Sa mga parts na feeling ko, mabilis siya mag-crease or mag-oil up. Okay, so I just did my brows at meron na akong separate video and if you want to check it out, ilalagay ko yung link dito or ilalagay ko na lang yung link sa description box. Okay, so now we're going to move to eyeshadow. Yung eyeshadow natin hanggat maaari ay gagating simple lang or medyo talagang parang glowy and pang daytime siya, ganun. So I'm going to use first this one from Peach C. This is their Falling In Eyeshadow Palette in number 2 or Falling In Peach. Sobra-sobrang cute ng eyeshadow palette na to. Although apat lang sila, makikita mo na you have all you need for an everyday makeup. So, kayaan ko nakikita nyo. If you want to buy this Peach C product, ito, tsaka ito Peach C na makeup base na ginagamit ko, I have this on my Kari shop. And, ayun, kung gusto nyo lang. So, I'll be linking their product links down below din kung gusto nyo sila i-check out. So, out of all the eyeshadows na nagkaroon ako, lahat ng shades, halos ang dami ko ng eyeshadows at magkakaiba yung shades. Although, aapat lang to. Ngayon ko lang nakita yung parang perfect para sa peach color itong dalawa. To. Ayan. Okay, so first I'm going to use this brush right here. At kinuha ko yung light peach color. Nilalagay ko lang siya as a transition shade. So nilalagay ko siya all over my lid. Next to that, pinagkasama ko na si pink at saka yung peach color. So pinagmimix ko sila. And then nilalagay ko siya sa may malapit na sa, sa lash line ko. Next to that, I'm going to use this much more smaller brush. At mag-focus na naman ako dun sa pink para lang i-intensify natin yung color ng eyeshadow. Tapos sasama ko na si lower lid. So, next to that is I've been loving this one from the VT Cosmetics XBTS Collection. And this is their eyeshadow na parang pot na dalawa yung shade. So, ayan. And I'm going to use the last one muna ito. Kasi para siyang pink na peachy, ganun. I'm going to put that here. Tapos, kakalat ko lang siya all over my lid. Kasi even, ang maganda kasi sa mga cream shadows ay sobrang long-lasting nila. So, even at the end of the day, makikita mo na talaga nakakapit pa rin siya. After that, gagamitin ko naman, ayun na sa ibabaw na part, ito. And then, ilalagay ko siya sa may lower lid ko. Gaganto ko, para siyang, para ako mag-squint, ganyan. Tapos, ilalagay ko siya dito sa may part na taas. Yeah. Okay, so after that, we're almost done with the eyes and we're just going to use an eyeliner. Kung anong eyeliner na meron kayo na dark brown, pero I have this one. This is a brow pen from Everblena. This is an all-day brow pen in the shade brunette yata. Pero ito yung ginagamit kong pang eyeliner kasi ayoko kong gumamit ng black since pag black sobra siyang parang sobrang intense ganun. So ito parang medyo light lang yung labas niya, ganun. <laughs> Sundan ko lang kung ano yung flattering sa eyes ko. Next is, papainitin ko lang to eyelash curler ko sa kilikili ko before I curl my lashes. Habang inaantay natin uminit yung lash curler natin, magkakontour lang ako and I've been using this one from BYS. It's their matte bronzing powder. So, I had this like forever. Uh, sobrang sakto kasi nung pagka bronzer niya sa akin. So, bo-bronze up ko lang ng konti yung face ko. Okay, so I'm also going to use that bronzer para medyo mag-contour tayo ng nose natin. Okay, since feeling ko medyo mainit-init na yung lash curler natin, curl ko lang yung lashes ko. Ayan, so I've been using this Maybelline Total Temptation Mascara. At kung nakikita nyo, sobrang taas na taas yung lashes ko once I use this one. So, after curling, ilalagay ko to and pagkalagay ko natuyo na siya, my lashes stays that way all day talaga as in. Tingnan nyo naman kung gano'ng hinaba or parang kung gano'ng kung, kung gano yun na nakikita yung lashes ko after applying this. Eh, almost halos wala akong lashes so. Okay, kung nakikita nyo, meron mga parang spaces dun sa lash line ko. So, fill in ko yan using this one from Maybelline. This is their Line Tattoo Crayon Pen, which is super long-lasting pero blendable. So, para lang siyang crayon. Pero once it's settled or once it's dry, sobrang hirap niya tanggalin. So, lalagay ko lang siya dun sa my sparse area. 
para magmukhang makapal yung lashes ko. Ayan. Now we are almost done with our look kasi hindi na ako mag-highlight since gusto ko na yung glow ng foundation or yung base makeup ko. We'll go straight na to our lips. And for my lips, I use these two products. Yung isa na si Irana. So this is the EB Matte Color Stick pa din na ginamit ko as my blush. Pero this time, I'm going to mix it with this one which is After Party. So ilalagay ko na si After Party sa aking lips. I'm going to use my fingers. And then after that, I'm going to apply over it the dull face one. Okay, so now we are done with our look. At sana nagustuhan nyo itong tutorial na to at nadalian lang kayo. So if you have any questions at any of the products that I have mentioned here, pwede kayo mag-comment below. Pero I will be putting all the details that I can put into the description box para dun sa mga ginamit kong product para screenshot nyo na lang yan. So ayun. And also for the links of those products na Alam ko kung saan nyo pwede bilhin yung mga legit ay, ayun, lalagay ko na din yung links in the description box. So, always, always, always check my description box. So, sana nagustuhan nyo itong video na to. Nagustuhan nyo yung makeup look natin. And that's it, guys. So, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.